sharing some new revelations tied to the disappearance and death of Washington intern Chandra Levy. Although he denied any involvement and was quickly dismissed as a suspect, speculation was rampant then that Congressman Gary Condit was somehow involved. Well, now, 15 years later, he is finally speaking out. And NBC's Joe Fryer has more on that story. Joe, good morning. Savannah, good morning. That's right. The Chandra Levy scandal ended the political career of Congressman Gary Condit. Now, for the first time in 15 years, he's sharing his thoughts on the scandal in his new book, Actual Malice. He sat down with Dr. Phil to talk about the book, and Dr. Phil gave us a preview. Why is it, after all these years, he's finally deciding to speak out now? Because he feels like he was tried and convicted in the court of public opinion. In 2001, the married congressman was accused of having an affair with government intern Chandra Levy. Does he address the question about his relationship with Chandra Levy? Most certainly. He addresses it with more candor and transparency than he ever has in the last 15 years. You developed a friendship with her and you saw her outside the office, correct? I saw her one time outside the office at, at a restaurant and she came by my condo uh -huh. once. She came by your condo once? Well, maybe twice, yeah, I think it was twice she came by. Okay. But so, once again, I, I, I wanna make this clear. There's nothing unusual about someone coming by my condo. A lot of people did. So, you know, people have made some, some speculation about that being something special, but I, I, you know. Well, were the police making something out of that? Well, they were trying to make something out of everything they could. A development shocking to Condit, considering he helped launch the investigation. When Chandra went missing, uh, her father uh, called my home in California, and he was, um, you know, extremely concerned about her whereabouts. Was he calling just because you were his congressman, or was he calling because he knew you had a relationship with Chandra? He knew that I was his, her congressman, and she'd come by the office, and and. Um, he had no other contact in Washington, D.C., so he called, my, he called my home. Was there ever a time that you weren't active in trying to help locate this young woman? No, I, I, I had made a commitment to Dr. Levy and Mrs. Levy that I would do everything I could to get the police engaged. It wasn't until 2010 that Ingmar Guandique, a man already serving time for sexual assault, was charged and found guilty of Levy's murder. But this year, after a retrial was ordered, prosecutors dropped the charges against Guandique altogether, saying they could no longer prove the case beyond a reasonable doubt. Now Condit has co-authored Actual Malice. This is an astoundingly candid book. This is not, um, a, a spin book. He's very critical of law enforcement. He's very critical of the media. He's very critical of himself. Condit tells Dr. Phil he kept gifts in his office and once gave Levy a gold bracelet. Kids would come in. I'd have 200 hats on two racks and I'd say pick a hat. So Chandra came into my office. She had a gift for me, which was chocolates. And I opened my drawer and reached and said, hey, we have one for you from the office. You're graduating, you're, you're getting your master's degree. Dr. Phil says Condit is a man at peace but also a man with unfinished business. And the unfinished business is that uh, no one is currently being held accountable for what happened to Chandra Levy, and that's painful for him. Throughout the scandal, Condit has denied having an affair with Levy. Dr. Phil says in this interview, Condit discusses the issue with more candor and transparency than ever before. The interview airs Thursday on Dr. Phil, Savannah and Matt. Okay, Joe Fryer, thank you. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.